Tender at the Bone, Growing Up at the Table, is a memoir by Ruth Reichel, a renowned food critic and former editor-in-chief of Gourmet Magazine. The book is a delightful combination of food and memories, where Reichel tells her story through the lens of food. In this literary analysis, we will explore the themes, literary devices, and writing style of Tender at the Bone. Themes The book revolves around the themes of food, family, and identity. Reichel's love for food was evident from an early age, and she uses food as a way to connect with her family and express herself. The book shows how food can be a source of comfort, joy, and healing. Reichel also writes about the impact of food on her identity, how it shaped her taste buds and influenced her career choices. Through her stories, she explores the role of food in shaping cultural and personal identity. Literary Devices Reichel's writing is infused with vivid sensory details, humor, and a strong narrative voice. She uses various literary devices to bring her stories to life. One of the most prominent devices is the use of metaphor. Reichel compares food to emotions, memories, and experiences. For instance, she describes a meal as a symphony of flavors and a cookbook as a passport to another world. These metaphors create a powerful imagery that engages the reader and makes the stories more relatable. Another literary device Reichel uses is imagery. She describes food in great detail, using sensory language that appeals to all five senses. For example, she describes a pastry as a flaky crust, boozing with raspberry jam, dusted with powdered sugar, and smelling of butter. These descriptions transport the reader into the scene and make them feel like they are tasting the food themselves. Writing Style Reichel's writing style is conversational and engaging. She writes in a first-person narrative, using a casual tone that makes the reader feel like they are listening to a friend's story. She also employs a humorous tone throughout the book, using wit and irony to create a light-hearted atmosphere. Her writing is easy to follow, and she avoids using overly complicated words or phrases, making the book accessible to a wide audience. Reichel also uses a nonlinear narrative structure, jumping back and forth between different periods in her life. This approach keeps the reader engaged and allows her to explore different themes and ideas. The book is divided into short, anecdotal chapters that are easy to read in one sitting. Each chapter tells a self-contained story, but they are all connected by the theme of food. Conclusion Tender at the Bone, Growing Up at the Table is a heartwarming and engaging memoir that uses food as a lens to explore themes of family, identity, and culture. Ruth Reichel's writing style is conversational and humorous, using vivid sensory details and metaphors to bring her stories to life. The book is a testament to the power of food and its ability to connect us to our past, present, and future. It is a must-read for anyone who loves food and enjoys a good story.